Hi, guys. It's me. You see, I got this present. I got the over from White House Day. I sent while it was all present. And our teacher told us a little secret. She said only to open it on Thursday night. And we're going to open it on Thursday night. But I think the bathroom's great. Andrew then ended up receiving a lifetime sentence with the possibility of parole after 50 years. At the actual sentencing, he did show remorse, and I believe it was Jane. Love can push you to do strange things, but to drive it to the point you're committing murders, those being of your parents, is a whole different level. It was not something that a child was supposed to do to their parents. It's unfortunate that they couldn't have both got help sooner and prevented the loss of life. The surviving Yondel brothers still find in their heart the ability to forgive and excuse Andrew's behavior to a certain degree. The human capacity to forgive is really quite amazing to me. go to oxygen.com their love story was a textbook example of how opposites attract he'd had aspirations of joining the air force she was a little rebellious a wild kind of teenager they were really drawn to each other but their romance would be ripped apart by an unthinkable crime the body was burned charred Okay. Woo! Got it. Alright, let's see who I need to know. Oh, he's out the way. I was thinking about him. Just a little bit loud. But I still got the person in the seat. So. Yeah. Let's hope he is. I'm gonna start from the back. That's good. Always have to take bands out of it. Always. Bands, bands, bands. Look at that band. February 13th, 1999. It's a quiet weekend in Florida Beach, a military town on the Florida Panhandle. Okaloosa County is primarily military community. Air Force Base, Hobart Air Force Base are the industries of our area. Conservative values, traditional values have always been in the forefront here. Thank you. Is that an iPhone or anything? So, no. I'm just kidding. I love it. So, it's on the box. So, it's on the box. So, it's on the box. Mark, I got this from my teacher. He was a pretty quiet, introspective person. Didn't have a huge circle of friends, but the friends that he did have cared about him deeply. Take all this.
this stuff out. I'll be right back. You're going to hear the TV. That's because I'm going to be doing the thing, guys. She's pregnant. It's a girl. His wife had a daughter from a previous okay. relationship. Okay. And he had adopted her. I got this stuff on the rack. And it turns out I got an LT problem. And uh, when it came out, I dropped it and it cracked. God dang. I am so mad. Like. Well, we're going to be playing a challenge with this. The present challenge. Oh, yeah. Well, we're not going to play the this from But I did order another phone just like this. And it's going to have a fake song and a real LG in for the giveaway. Since you guys are so nice and I ordered this off the line, you might get one of these just because you always watch my videos and you support the show. But... I will not be sharing it giveaway the and see you over next year because I want to update this phone just because it's not updated to your name, I'm not going to put my name because you're not going to be on my account. That's a B no to the no to the no to the no. But you guys are going to get one of these. But when it comes off the storyline, so got this from Amazon. Well, not Amazon. Got it from Wish. And it will be coming. I won't promise you it will come, yo. I won't. All I know that I ordered it and it's coming. Can't believe my teacher did that. Crystal tells police she has been renting the room for Cordell Richards for the past two months. Crystal was but, dating Ron, yep. but she had been kicked out of her home, but, and she was looking for a place so, to stay. In. Cordell Richards had so, had so, so. a roommate, and so, so Ron, wait. Bill, and Crystal so. approached Cordell Richards, so, so. and Cordell Richards said, "Sure."